We've made it over to the Tornos booth, one of my favorite places to be because precision is one of the key importances to grow in your machine shop. And that's why I like to be here as well. I got Dobby with me today and we're gonna learn why and where and who. Dobby, we're starting here with the Swiss Nano, but Tornos here in Brazil, so incredible, bringing the precision that is so craved here in Brazil these days. Yes, here we have Tornos subsidiary here in, in Brazil and we are bringing the best of the best machines in Swiss type machines. So thank you for your visit and welcome to the Tornos booth. Yeah, welcome to everyone watching as well. And uh, let's start with the Swiss Nano. Now, as I travel around the world, Davi, I hear all the time, my floor pace is expensive. My energy is expensive. Uh, labor, labor is hard to find. All of these Great. complications. So we're looking for machines that can do more. We're looking for machines with smaller floor space. Yes. We're looking for machines with energy efficiency. All of these components at the end of the day help us save money and make more money. And you have to add precision. Yes. Thermal stability and for sure more productivity. So, I mean, that's true. I mean, we do face those problems here in Brazil as well. So imagine that in 80 meters, square meters, we can put 10 machines of this. I mean, imagine how, how productive your, your plant can be. It's crazy, yeah. Yeah, the, the space, the fact that you can drop a bar feed, you yes. can run second shift, third shift. For those out there watching, this is how you can run through the nights and weekends with maybe one shift, one operator, with That's the precision true. you can trust that when it comes off the machine, it's gonna be correct. Yep. And I even heard rumors from some of your customers that I had the opportunity to speak with that they're making 40% more products. They're getting yes. more out of everything. That's important to understand as well. Yeah, that's true. I mean, because again, we have the precision and what happened is you can have a, a ghost ship, you know, because you have the, the stability and the precision of the machine. And yes, as it is a small machine, so you don't have to, you know, long runs to, or long movements to make it happen you know, to produce that, to, to produce the part. So that's why we have all this advantage. So, yes. <laughs> and Davi, this is a six plus two, I believe, right? Yes, that's a six axis plus two C linear axis. Yes. It pretty much sounds like I can get a lot done. Yes, yes, yeah, and yeah. And up to 10 millimeters? Up to 10 millimeters. This is a brand new, uh, it's a launch here in Brazil. So we have like four different machines. We are launching here in Expo Mafia. They are brand new for the Brazilian market and the Swiss Nano 10 is a brand new. We had the four and five, uh, the seven millimeters and here's the 10. So which means that you can have more flexibility and produce different parts with this machine. Yeah, really interesting to understand because when I see the footprint, I, I my head doesn't wrap around 10 millimeters, but we're getting there and we can do more and yeah. flexibility. Yeah. I wanna move on to the next machine though. Let's go. And for everyone watching, this is the first time you're gonna see this here in Brazil. And that's important to understand, right Davi? For sure, for sure. This is our brand new machine, our main launch here in Brazil. We are talking about the XT32. So what makes this machine special? We are talking about uh, eight to nine uh, axes with two linear axes. So we can go up to 11 axis so i mean it's a quite flexible machine another point we can work with three different tools simultaneously so you can improve a lot your uh produ production yes some of my favorite videos ever to watch which also uh being that they're productive in real life uh -huh. are things like pinch turning yes. knowing that i can do run three at one time I can already see the reduction of overall cycle time by being able to run top, bottom, side, all of these go. different aspects of the machine. And again, we're still in that world of precision, aren't yeah. we? Imagine that this machine, you can do uh, the turning and the finishing at the same time. That's why you save, you save time and money for sure, right? So uh, this machine, you can go up to 32 millimeters, well, bar, the bar, 32 millimeters. You have, we have the 16 millimeters as well. So, I mean, it's a quite flexible machine. Another point about flexibility. You can see that we have a lot of room here. That is a lot of space. Yes. So what happened is we, we have space to have different price of different uh, parts pre already preset inside machine. So you can leave it running 
different parts. I mean, so that's what a really good point that you can you can help only with this machine. Uh, can I buy one now? There you go. Can, I, 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 I we do have a good promotions here in Brazil. <laughs> I, I, I do want one right now. I mean, it just yeah. it seems like I'm. I, I have conversations, Davi, and, and I'm going to break down this conversation for you where I can do multiple things inside of a CNC machine, yes. right? But typically, I'm going to do one at a time. I'm going to do maybe a facing and then a turning, and then maybe I'm going to come do some live drilling. Uh -huh. or so you're doing it all, almost all at yes. one time. Yes, yes. And the point is, you, your part leaves the machine done. I mean, exactly that's, right. the, that's the point about productivity. You don't have to take your part, take to another uh, another machine and you know have all the problems about the zero the you know all the pro problems that we have uh, going from to another machine this one no you have the bar you keep it running and you have all done in one machine so and I actually have a piece right here just as a demo which is yes. kind of a I'm gonna get a little oil on my fingers but it's worth it for the interview I tell you that but it shows all the different things that you can do Davi and I want to bring up your point again, if that's okay. And that's that done in one idea or one and done. Yes. Out. And it's the ability to walk away, to press go, walk away, let it run, yes. press go on five more machines. Yes. They're all running at the same time. And when they're finished, they go into a box. That's productivity. That's the productivity. And the point is you don't have, you don't need to have five different people on one in each, each machine. You know, you can have one, two uh, employees, you know, working on the machines and you have you know, it's you save uh, money and time and and people and as you said in the beginning, labor nowadays it's quite hard to find. So I mean, if you have someone that is capable to run different machines at the same time, that's the best you can get. Let's slide on over to the third machine we have over here on the booth, Davi, and this one is famous in Brazil, isn't it? I mean, yes. it seems like every shop has one. There you go. <laughs> that, that's true because you know. Uh, our DT line, what happened is it's our most flexible and cost benefit machine here in Brazil. Okay, and yeah, we are bringing this brand new machine which we call DT38 HP. Which, you know, when you think about Swiss type machines, you think about, you know, delicate uh, 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 parts, small Fragile, parts, yes. Yeah, all that stuff. Imagine now we can have up to 38 millimeters uh, bar. So you can work with, you know, you can do big parts, you know. That's that's the, the idea. So we are showing here is the how the strength and flexibility of our machines. Okay, let's take a step back to the Swiss world. A lot of us do think of it as, as fast and uh -huh. maybe a little bit dainty, right? We're not gonna really hog something out, right? Yes. We're, we're not doing the ah like, but this one can do some roughing yes. work. This one can yes. really put in the work, can it? So we have here five axes plus two linear axes. So we still have a lot of uh, capabilities. You know, different. You can do different uh, operations, but yes, we do have the strength to, to work with. And the point is, of all our machines, uh, for sure, XT or all the DT uh, HP, the spindle, the main spindle, and the sec, uh, the the sub spindle, they have the same power, the same, you know, HP. What happened is, you can actually do this almost the same operations in the main and the sub spindle. What happened is. The concept uh, that we are working with is if you do 60% in one spindle and 40% in another one, one spindle will be, you know, stopped for a little moment. If you can go up to 50 50, you, you never stop. And that's the idea. And to do that, we have a, a quite strong machine that we can, you can absorb all the, the vibration and absorb all the energy working with to the spindle. So that's, that's the the benefits and all the characteristics that we can talk about. The so no longer a sub spindle, but a counter spindle. We, there we you have go. now two options to do get it 50 50. Yep. The last thing I want to bring up because the nano where we started, we're talking micron, if not sub micron precision. Yes. I mean, the, the tolerances, but every single one, if we're being fair, Switzerland makes a very high quality product and all of these Tornos machines are going to hit that tight tolerance that the people out there yeah. need. But I want to look real quickly, Blazer, Rigo, Dunner. I know it's programmed by the folks over at Solid Camp. I mean, you have a lot of partners that go into making sure that your machine is supported by quality as well, making sure that your clients and customers out there are reaching the precision they're looking for. There you go. I mean, if you buy a really good machine, but you're but the machine is not only the machine. You still have the collets, the tools, as you said, the the, the guide bush. So I mean, if the if the 
And the, the objective of our client, it's our machine build the limit, it's work in the limit. If you work with bad uh, accessories or bad partners, a bad quality, call it, you, you have a, a really good machine, but your, your limit, your, uh, you know, your machine will produce in the limit of the call it, which is quite, quite uh, uh, you know, cheap in comparison to your machine. So, I mean, it doesn't make sense. You have really bad quality guide bush or oil, you know, everything in a good machine. So that's why we have really good partners, mainly Swiss partners. And well, they're here with us in Expo Mafia and helping us to make really good parts for our customers. <laughs> Davi, I don't know how rich you are, but I can't afford a Ferrari. However, my point is, if I was to buy a Ferrari one day, if I could ever afford a Ferrari, I wouldn't put junk rims on it. There you I go. wouldn't put junk tires on it. I wouldn't put junk oil in it. I would make sure that all of it is running to the perfection yeah. of how the machine was yes. built. Yes. Very much like this Tornos. Yeah. And that's why these partners are so important. There you go. I mean, if you have a Ferrari, you want stability. And if you can't want to, if you go to the track, you go to the limit. If you have bad rims, I mean, your limit will be the tire, not your car. And that, that's the point. I mean, that's true, yeah. Yeah, so I'll see you at the Formula One races coming up soon, right? I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Davi, thank you so much for thank your you, time. Man. I hope this has been educational for you guys. This is Tornos. This is Tornos in Brazil. This is Expo Mafe. It continues to thrive and grow here. This is a go-to machine, but we have a one that's revealed here and then micro, micro precision that could save you floor space, time, and even some of the workers that you might be trying to get right now. And Davi is here to help you out as well as the rest of my friends here at Tornos. Thank you all for watching. We will see you again soon. Thank you.